The time is half past four in the morning. We did not have a good sleep. You can't close the windows here and we're on a very busy street. So yeah, just really, really loud all night. To be honest, I'm actually kind of happy that we have to get up early because we didn't have to sleep through another three, four hours of that. But yeah, we are waiting on a taxi now, which is gonna bring us to the bus station where we're gonna get a nine hour bus, I think, to San Salvador, the capital of El Salvador. Good morning, Vincent. Good morning. How'd you sleep? Good. Nice. No, no, no. <laughs> it's, it's the morning. We'll forgive you. <laughs> we booked a taxi last night, and it's 10 minutes late at this stage. We're slightly getting worried. What else did we we booked a taxi last night? A noche? E no es aquí? No, I. No. Tell me, we have a lot of people. Martine. That's not the taxi. So the security guard that I talked to is now going to bring us himself in his own car. I can go in the back. Someone else is doing navigation with him. Vincent's taken. You're going in as well. Vincent and Martine taking over the team, going in the back. Sure. <laughs> I'll do the navigation in the front. Yeah. Buenos días. 29. Gracias. Right, we have arrived at the border and there's dollars. Okay. This way? Yeah. yeah. Gracias. So we are officially out of Honduras and we just converted our Honduran money to the dollar, which is what they take in El Salvador. Our next stop now is to drive to the border and go through immigration on the other side. I think, if I'm not mistaken, that we are through immigration. A guy just came on and took our information for our passports there, so no need to get out, which was great. Now they're checking the bus for drugs. Do you need drugs? I don't think so. Do you? I might. Gibson definitely does. Grapes and guam. Just while they're searching the bus here, I'm gonna talk about this company. We paid $25 for this ticket, and we're going all the way from Tegucigalpa to San Salvador, which is a fairly, fairly good deal. We're stopping for a little 15 minute break to get some food. My first food of the day, even though it's probably around 11 o'clock at this stage. Bus driver means business. We literally had about five minutes there, so we're bringing it back on the bus now. And I wouldn't be fond of drinking, but when I go at it, I do go at it awful and very hard. Originally our plan was to stay a night in San Salvador, but we've made such good progress we're just going to keep going to Santa Ana, which is in the west of the country, and then that's going to be our starting point to go all the way to the east and then on to Nicaragua. I cannot speak highly enough about this bus company. Absolutely amazing service. Fine. Yeah. Ten amigo. Muchas gracias. Mucho gusto. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, f <laughs> He's letting us cross.
Next little problem now, the bus has dropped us way out of town, so we need to figure out how we're going to get to this hostel. Hopefully a taxi. We've got a taxi ordered for us. Mm. Para cinco personas? Yeah, it's in that mm, We can squeeze. Mm. More squeezing into taxis. <laughs> Gracias. This is our hostel finally. Hola. Hola. Thank you so much. And this is the room, three beds. That looks kind of like halfway between a single and a double, and then a double over here, and a bathroom. Well, I assume it's a bathroom. It is. Oh. Here in Santa Ana, finally, I am not doing anything else for the rest of the day. So I'm gonna leave the vlog there. I'll see you in the next one. Actually, if you are enjoying these videos, please consider liking and subscribing and all of that jazz. We are doing a volcano hike today. How's it going? Yeah, better than that Catanango. <laughs>